Hello everyone and welcome to the Endless Rise VIP webinar series. Clearly today we are going to be going over mastering the SEO sales pitch. And on the SEO sales pitch we're going to, going to be going over the difference between the technical sales pitch and the value sales pitch. And most people do not really recognize that there's a difference between one or the other and we will make it clearly apparent what the difference is and how to qualify your lead on what type of sales pitch to give them. Can everyone do me a favor? Let me know if my audio is coming through clearly, if you're seeing the screen okay. Just to make sure we're getting started off right. All right. Albert, Timothy, Mike, Richard, thank you for responding and a bunch of other people. Wonderful. So everyone can hear me and see the screen okay. Now, Everyone, let me know, <clears throat> how many of you out there have seen the Turn One Lead into 50 video, or how many of you were on the webinar at that point in time? Because this has a little bit to do with it, but I need to gauge how many people were on or saw that video, Turn One Lead into 50. I emailed it out to everyone. It's a very important video. All right. Wonderful. The majority of you are saying that you did see the video. That was not a typical webinar. That was not an okay video to see. That is a must-see mandatory video for you to boom your sales. If you missed that video, log into the dashboard, go to the video library, go to the webinar archive like you always do and find the latest webinar on turn one lead into 50 that was groundbreaking. My next question is for everyone on the webinar, how many of you attended the webinar last night on the lead generation tool? It was on with David. I got Joseph saying yes, Stuart saying me, Damon, Donald, most of you were on it. If you were not on it, you missed out tremendously. That was probably one of the most groundbreaking sales generation lead generating tools I have ever seen in my life and, and by far none it was. That was last night's webinar. Uh, there's going to be an encore of it after this one at 4 p.m. and I will be recording, uh, I will be uploading the recording to the webinar library and I'll email everyone to let you know about that but that software was groundbreaking so I just wanted to take a quick poll and see how many people were on that webinar and it looks like a lot of people were so that's good alright so what I'm gonna be going over of course is going to be on the technical sales pitch versus the value sales pitch and maybe some of you are experienced with pitching SEO and what SEO is all about and I suppose before I continue too far into this if you're looking to enter uh, to interface with anything else maybe you've got some dual monitors running I want to make sure that everyone understands how to view and see our SEO services so how do you view the SEO services if you want to well go to the services tab right here on the top of your dashboard click on services and the first services that pops up down below is the SEO local buzz and website audits. On this it shows you your costing on it and then there's a button that says view package details. When you click on that package details button you are going to see that we have revamped our package details. And we are going to do this for all the services but so far we've only gotten through the website audit, SEO and local buzz. When you get to here, when you want to view the package details, you click on which one, and when you click on SEO, it will take you to an overview. You can download the marketing collateral that you can send to your client, 
and then you enter in the basic or advanced and I'm going to be going over the advanced. Uh, in this new interface you'll see that for you to learn the SEO packages if you just scroll over the question mark the comment box will pop out and these look a lot better right is this not better than the old Excel sheets it's definitely a lot better our marketing team did a good job <clears throat> and several people requested that we increase our interface which isn't hard to do it's just we thought that Excel is adequate it's just line item details but I understand that presentation does matter so we redid this for you and if you scroll down to the very 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 bottom of the packages you will see that we put the line items also down here at the bottom so that you could come down here and if you just wanted to read through more in book style the only thing we have left to do in this interface is to give you a PDF out button which the dev team is working on and when that's done you're going to be able to PDF these out these package details just with the packages and have all of the descriptions down at the bottom if you want them or we're going to give you the ability to remove them so yeah I suppose announcing yes we do have a new service details and it looks wonderful so the PDF ability will be out on this soon alright so these advanced package details this is a lot of this is what I'm going to be going over but I'm going to try to stick to the PowerPoint I just want everyone to know that's on the line that if you need to go into this and you need to do your research and to understand our services this is how you get into it you go to your services you click on view package details you get into this interface you click on SEO services choose basic or advanced and now you can learn because everything is there and spelled out all right so with that being covered I'm going to get back to the slideshow now to ramp up your SEO sales particularly which by the way is the most profitable online marketing sale that you can have right now the SEO sales definitely give the highest profit margin for you from an outsourcing perspective but they also make the most impact to most local service providers but whenever you get into get into pitching SEO there's really two different types of sales approaches that you need to be prepared for and there's the technical sales pitch and there's the value sales pitch so what is the value sales pitch the value sales pitch is geared towards a particular audience so let's just say that maybe you uh, had a conference or maybe you just got a bunch of leads and you pull them into your leads queue and how do you classify someone that you want to take your value sales pitch towards well first of all you might have to talk to that client at one time but after talking to that client you'll need to understand if they are non-technical if the lead or client does not understand the technical aspects of SEO then they're non-technical like technology adopters maybe they don't even know how to work their computer very well uh, if they are more business oriented than technically oriented or they're really into the profit side of things or they're really wanting to know more about the competition analysis then you take the value sale so the value sales pitch is really geared towards your leads or clients that are non-technical or they're very focused on you showing them what their competition is doing or they're very profit oriented and they want to see mainly the ROS, ROI side of things and that really makes sense so what are the needs that a value sales pitch will address more customers more sales more revenue higher profit higher ROI but notice in any of those it doesn't address what is it how does it work what are the technical details if someone's not looking for the technical components or they're not already technical or you don't need to go there then you take the value sales pitch now in terms of the value sales pitch tools just a quick rundown on what would be there for that if you're trying to s sell someone based on value because they're non-technical how do you establish the value of the traffic that you're showing them in the keyword re research interface which we provide to you for free 
and you can give to them. Well, you want to you wanna compare the cost per click on it versus the traffic to show them the value, and that's in our keyword information tool, which you get for free. And then you can also compare them with the competitors in the keyword competition analysis, and you have the sales collateral. Now, real quick, for every single person in attendance right now, which there's a lot of you out there, I need to know this. How many of you know how to get the keyword information and the free research we give you? How many of you know how to go about getting that? Great. Wonderful. That means that you watched the videos and you were responsible. Literally, 90% of everyone is saying, yes, I do. So, great. If you don't know how to do that, go to the video library in the resources and watch the quick vi launch video series. And there's five videos. It takes you 30 minutes to get through all the videos. If you haven't watched those, you're not pre-qualified to understand what we're going to be talking about. It's five videos. It's 30 minutes. I suppose you could watch them later. For the, for the 5 or 10 percent that, that does not know how to avail of that. Comparison with the competition's performance. Keyword competition analysis. For those that know how to get the keyword research, you know how to get the competition analysis. Last question on this slide. How many of you know how to get the sales collateral? We got sales collateral for what? SEO, PPC, local, site audits, web design? Awesome. Impressive. Almost everyone knows where to go to get that. If you don't know where to go to get that, you really need to go there. And if you need the Word version document of that, that will be uploaded. And actually, since I have my trusted co-pilot on silent here answering your question, Stephen will be able to post in the public chat the URL to where you can get that sales collateral, not only in PDF format, but you can now download it in the Word format and brand it all you want. For you to make that sales collateral, it would take you at least one to two weeks, literally. Uh, so, Stephen, if you need to coordinate with CJ, you can get the URL off the Endless Rise website to give everyone that URL so that they can find that in Word format. And you can post that in the chat and, and go ahead and broadcast it out to everyone. Okay. The technical sales pitch. So who do you think is a technical sales pitch? And how many of you out there have had to deal with a technical sales pitch? You walked in thinking that your, your website grader report and your research and the stuff that we give you was enough. Maybe you haven't memorized all the line items on the SEO. Maybe you don't fully understand the mechanics and the methodology on why our SEO is so amazing. And you got stuck in a technical sales pitch with someone that knew what they were doing and they cornered you.